Yeah, guys, welcome back to new video. In today's video, yes, we're we'll talking about tropical cyclone Bart Zero yet again, and maybe for some more potential systems that's over here. But we're not going to be talking about those systems today. We're going to, when they get marked in the JTWC map here and here, and I'll talk about them. But there is meant to be a potential system here that's meant to go up. Like this, and affect the same exact places that Bat Zero is going to affect. So, you know, if Madagascar is in the gun yet again, but that's like a week away. I'll show you the model ones for that. But as you can see, this is the JTWZ cone. But now, saying it's um, 70 knots still, which I think that's a bit. Outlandish to say the least, but you know, um, yeah, that's uh, the incline. So eighty-five, then eighty, then eighty-five, then ninety, then ninety, then ninety-five, then one hundred, then one hundred and five. At this, when it gets here at this point, it's going to be, probably might become a Category 4 with 110 mile an hour winds. With 110 knots. So, or it could get to 120 knots. So, if it moves any more, so, so if it moves any more south like that. Landfall could be on those islands. Now, <laughs> oh, sorry about that, guys. Now, that's what is that's what the models are trending it to go more south like that and make a suddenly Madagascar landfall. Now, if that happens, it will weaken down here because the SSTs down here are very low down here. Where it is right now, it's luckily it's in warm SSTs, and it, luckily the models want some of the models want it to turn a bit to more, to, more towards the north. Some of the models want it to make landfall like that. Some of the models want it to go like that. Some of the models want it to go really far south like that. Now, some of that won't happen. Some of it will, but. Just have to wait and see which model is outlandish or not. So, um, so this is now so this is this is the cone of uncertainty right now. It could pass. It could pass anywhere. It could pass anywhere in that cone. Anywhere in that cone. So now I'm going to show you some satellite imagery. And while we're here, guys, you see this massive extropical system over the UK. It's bringing us some very gusty winds. Also, you see this very long frontal boundary here. This is a, this this brought snow to Texas, um, New York. And it's now delivering some snow to like Nova, Nova Scotia, New York, Newfoundland, and some parts of Canada and the Midwest like that. So watch out there if you live anywhere there. Um, there's a cyclone here, which actually it's kind of strong, but at the same time, let's be careful. There was a hundred and thirteen millibar low pressure system right here, and it made landfall on Iceland as a hundred and four, a hundred and forty miles an hour, but it. It is now affecting Salababa, whatever this country name is. That's at least a thousand miles away from us. At least a thousand miles away from us. 
So if our low pressure was going to affect us, you know, it would be a thousand miles away. So you know, it could affect us, but at the same time, it might not at the same time. So so anyway, so this is cyclone. About zero right now, as you can see, this side here has no convection because the wind is because of that wind shear, as like that. But it's still powerful because the system is 80 miles an hour, it's meant to go up to 90, then 100, and 105, and 105, and 110, and 115, and 120. Now, it could get to 100, it could get to 110, not just 125, 130 knots, you know, 100, 125 knots is 130 30 miles an hour, so if it makes time for us, 145 miles an hour, anywhere on Madagascar, we can zoom the Earth once, probably wants it to go south like that. Luckily, these islands aren't going to be affected, but if any any more south it goes, if it goes any more south, these guys could easily get hurricane force winds. And if it goes any more south than that, you could see and a great tip on the coast, but if it goes even further south, you could see a landfall right over those, those two countries. Like that, so basically that won't happen, or it could just m completely miss Madagascar and its islands, and just do a halute loop towards the north, and come down and just become a bomb X tropical system down here. So, so yeah, um, I'll show you tropical tibets now. Here we go. So, satellite imagery, tropical storm bot zero. Yeah, uh, they are failing that zero like crazy. Um, they need to set up their um, things, but I'm going to show you the model ones. GFS bot zero. They have it as 978 millibars right now. I do have it strengthening the whole of this way. They have it as 940 millibars for an example, but then they have it as 9, 986 millibars re strengthening off the coast of Madagascar. Now, whether it will be, whether it will be named um, back to zero, we don't know. Probably will keep its name about the zero. But if its remnants die and it becomes another system, it could be the C name system. So now I'm going to show you satellite imagery on weather nerds. So, guys, here is the satellite imagery for Bart Zero right now. Now, this is IR because this is not really imagery. It's It's IR basically. So the IR imagery, and right, you can see the system got blown up minus 90 degree cloud tops. We're looking really good right now. We don't know if there's an eye trying to form, but respects to the storm if it is trying to form an eye. But if you go on water vapor right now right you can see in some sort of an eye now i don't know if that is an eye or not but props if it is because this system did have an eye but you know it's looking good on water vapor so yeah anyway guys we enjoyed the video 
Don't forget to subscribe to Curtis's channel. Go and watch his video. Get, in, get his video up to 100 views. Well, it's nearly up there, but just get it up to like 200 if you can. So, yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy your video. Hope, guys, hope you guys enjoy the video. I've got the 2017 animation coming out soon. Watch that. Support. Support Cyclone Tracking Arts, support Force 13, and support Curtis Implied, and support Joy Tracking as well, who makes all my animations. So, yeah, respect to them. So, yeah, anyway, peace. Hope you guys have a good day. Give me up to 100 subscribers by the, by the end of August. I know you guys can do it. So, yeah. Anyway, peace. Have a great day and stay safe in the system. Good, goodbye.